just wanted to say real quick that I'm doing it this way because I do not have an oil filter wrench with me. This is another way to do it that is if you have to. If you have to, you take the screwdriver and you hit it all the way in the back. Nowhere past the half front. You hit the oil filter housing, you hit it there. With a screwdriver and a hammer. After you've turned it about twice with the screwdriver, you do two holes and you turn it once and twice, you usually be uh, able to turn it hand tight. I did it hand tight before, but sometimes it'll tighten itself up uh, in between oil changes. It's easier to do it with a screwdriver or the oil filter wrench, which I don't have right now. Let that all drain out. Keep turning it. let it drop down to the oil pan. By the way, the amount of oil that this car takes, which is 5W30, which I've pointed at earlier in the video, the amount of oil it takes is one whole five quart bottle and then a half quart bottle of this. And also as a tip, with this engine, it's, it's reliable as long as you keep changing the oil on time. But it's also a good thing to save this other half and put maybe like a tenth of a quart in every you know 500 miles or so, keep it topped off. Mine needs that. Just keep her running good. So, yeah. All right. I also normally use Royal Purple, which is very good. I sometimes hear timing chain noises on this car, which I have not replaced yet. They're still original. And uh, I usually use Royal Purple, and the noises go away. It's a very good product. But since this time the place I went to did not have royal purple, I figured this would be the next best thing. So. To make sure you do 0.5, five and a half quarts. There we go. 
I'm a little bit over 5.5 because I used one tenth of it before. There you go. That's it. That's all there is to it. If you want more videos, like and subscribe. See you on the next one. I also forgot one last thing. It was uh, that this goes on here. You tighten this up with the uh, flathead screwdriver. Tighten this up with the flathead screwdriver on here. And then this P uh, PVC or PCV tube goes into here. And then the bolt goes back into here. Um, there. And that's it.